Hey, it's Jeremy, back with another video. Um, just another, just showing off another one of my builds. Uh, this one here was not so much something I custom built, just more something I modified. Uh, for I luckily was able to get some an Electrum Neophyte that was empty. And the first thing that came to mind is there's the switch plate was gone. Uh, first thing that came to mind is I want to, maybe I should put a crystal chamber in there. And I was thinking where I put the switches. And I had, uh, well, I had a switch box like this from a, uh, Evil Flex, uh, which was really cool and actually worked out really nice. So uh, I did a few mods on it to actually get it to fit. And it's got a couple tactile switches underneath the plate. So this is it right here. Uh, my Electrum Neophyte, really battle worn one. And I got the Evil Flex switch box. And a switch plate from Electrum here. I've got two tactile switches in this. And it came out really nice. Um, uh, this one here, but because of that, I was able to put this custom crystal chamber. Let's see. Camera. Camera. Hello. This custom crystal chamber in there. Now this is just a uh, crystal chamber I made out of... Uh, brass washers, some screws, some state, some uh, a bunch of different parts that I had with a real quartz crystal in there, and yeah, it's turned out really nice. The little crystal chamber type piece, uh, and it works really nice. And I got a custom blade plug here that's sort of like. Kind of like a James Bondish type thing. It's actually really cool. <laughs> it's got the like James Bond gun barrel swirl piece to it. But yeah, this uh, this one here is uh, also is because of the the uh, room now with the crystal chamber here. I couldn't put uh, the D three back in a D three. So uh, I've got a shorter chassis that I pulled out of a uh, Vader's Vault that I had. And I put the Golden Harvest version 3 in here with a uh, nice, with using the Vader's Vault uh, speaker. I think it's like a 22 millimeter speaker. It's really nice. But fits nicely tight in there. Uh, nice up in there, so uh, this pulls out to it slides out so I can have access to everything, anyways. Uh, so, uh, yeah, here, I'll just so it's run this one's running a CC Sabres connector in there. And a pixel on the crystal chamber, which turns out really beautiful looking. You just headbutted. I was just headed by curious. I'm a god curious. By the way, this is uh, uh, the Pilgrim by Forza, uh, Forza Effects. Really cool sound fun if you're a Scott Pilgrim fan. So. I was just a little bit curious. Punch me in the boob. Prepare to die, obviously. I put a uh, twist retraction on there. Uh, so, yeah, it's running the latest firmware on the Golden Harvest, so. Sound menu. Months of attacking Imperial targets and Vader sends a boy to fight me? So this is the... 
There's an ice cream. The crystal just basically lines up with the uh, blade, so it turned out really nice. So this, uh, I'll just put a blade in here. So a lot of things with it, sometimes they would, uh, with the older firmware, the CC sabers would actually have a pixel end up lighting up after it was turned off. New with firmware, it does not light up. So it's, it's been taken care of on the golden harvest so just in case people are worried about that sometimes i would see it here and there about with uh with the uh it's a tight fit in this thing. make sure i got it yep so yeah Yeah, this is uh, my modded neophyte with the crystal chamber. The power of self -respect. So yeah, this turns out really nice. Anyways, uh, so yeah, thanks for watching.